What up everybody? Today I'm covering a topic that I really don't actually want to happen. Personally, I hope that book two lasts 10 plus more seasons. But at the end of the day, I got to cover every angle and I'm not going to ignore the possible warning signs that season four might be the last of book two ghost. But the good news is with the ending of one show, possibly comes the birth of another spinoff or two. So at the end of this video, I will go over the possible book five or book six spinoff possibilities. Because we were all upset when Power ended, but we got three fire spinoffs and Power almost year round in return. So it might not all be bad news. Get me to what is the warning signs that I'm talking about that has me thinking that it is a possibility that season four could be the last of book two. Starting off with the most recent news from Gianni Paolo who plays Braden Instagram page. A fan asked him in the comments section when book two was going to return and Gianni's reply was 2025. This means we're going to have to wait a whole nother year before getting season four. And I'm also going to add the fact that they've been finished recording for several months now also. This means that most likely season three of Force will air before season four of book two. Getting the two shows timelines caught up. Then that's when things might get crazy. Because we might actually see Braden and Tariq in Chicago on for season three. Before we see them back on the screen in book two. The article I read said that Force was going to start recording season three in February. So production would be done in time for most likely an October return date, followed by the final season of Book Two Ghost. The next warning sign is the fact that Michael Rainey Jr., who plays Tariq, has already been said that he doesn't want to become a typecast. And that people already do call him Tariq everywhere he goes. Season four will be Rainey's 10th season on power. And the young actor might want to try his hand in taking his talents to the movie screen or different kinds of roles. Not to mention the celebrity power that book two is carrying. Method Man, Mary J. Blodge, Lorenz Taint, and Woody McClain. How long will these high profile celebrities want to keep doing the same show? Also add the fact that people are starting to call them by their character names also and not by their real names. That might have them want to move on to new ventures sooner than later also. The next warning sign comes from the Crew Has It podcast. Michael and Gianni haven't done a new episode in over two months. Is that podcast over with or is it going to return? Did they finish the podcast because book two is over with after season four? The final warning sign came from the Crew Has It podcast when Gianni said that he had to do a speech in front of a whole bunch of people that he kept messing up on because it was initially supposed to be just read as a voiceover. Now think about it. Why would Braden have to give a speech in front of a whole bunch of people? The only place I can see this happening at is a funeral or a memorial. And I initially thought that it would most likely be at Robert or Trace Weston's funeral. But after thinking about it, they don't usually show funerals for small time characters especially a whole speech at a funeral. Usually they only show funerals for main characters. So this got me thinking that Braden was given that speech at Tariq's funeral. So the big question is, if that is in fact Tariq's funeral, what character do you think is worthy of taking out Tariq St. Patrick? Because there's no character currently on the show who Tariq has snaked because he has been loyal and good to all of them. So the only characters in my eyes who have a legit reason to take out Tariq would be either Elisa Marie Proctor for Tariq lying to her and send her father up to be killed or someone from Kanan's past to get revenge on Tariq for setting Kanan up to die. And the only other character besides that, in my opinion right now, would be Ghost returning to kill Tariq for trying to kill him. But at the end of the day, season four could change a lot and give someone else a motive for taking Tariq out also. Getting me to the book five spinoff ideas. If this is actually the last season of book two goes. Starting off with James St. Patrick returning in book five resurgence. Returning to New York City after the death of his son to restore his name. Ghost would come back and pin everything on Tariq and Tasha. Just like they tried pinning everything on him. 
letting them know that he faked his death because he was shot by his own son and that he feared for his life. But for this to play out, that would also mean that Tasha would have to be gone at this point. That would be because Cash Grant found out that Tasha was responsible for killing his mother and avenges Lakeisha's death by smoking Tasha. Braden would survive the show and move to Chicago to be with Tommy Egan after finding out that Tommy is actually his biological father. Then we could see Braden, D-Mac, and Marshall teaming up on force. Effie and Diana Tejada would both survive one way or another and move to California to go to school at Stanford and get their own spinoff, either book five or book six, depending on if they can get Omari back for another spinoff or not. The feds would start pressuring Davis McLean concerning all the crimes he committed, including killing the man that Theo went to prison for. And he turns into a snitch before getting killed by Monet. Kane would eventually find out that Drew was behind the plan to put a hit out on Monet and kill his brother. While Diana would eventually kill Kane and frame Monet for his murder so she can cut all ties with her family. Monet would end up getting arrested and having to serve a life sentence for murder. This way they could always bring Monet back into the storyline in the future by having her released like Ronnie or something like that. And there you have it. Will season four be the last of book two ghosts? Leave your thoughts, theories, and predictions in the comments.